Hello, you little beauties. Welcome back to my second channel. Welcome back to Jack in the Books. Now, as you know, I am the founding father of the Sally Rooney Defense League. I love her. I love her so much. <laughs> I love her books. I love her writing. I think she's so brilliant. And there's a series coming out of one of her books. As I hope we all know by now, the series of normal people was just perfection. I think that they brought that book to life so perfectly. The tone was so true and authentic to the book. Um, the actors were the perfect casting choice for the characters of um, Marianne and Connell. That series had me feeling all the fucking feels. I, <laughs> I just loved it so much. I think they did a stellar job and Normal People is one of my favourite books ever, so I'm really pleased that they, they did it justice, you know? And now we have a trailer for conversations with friends. Holy shit. I'm so excited. I can't even tell you. I cannot wait for this series. Um, I think it's being created and developed by the same people. It's a Hulu X BBC3 production again. So I'm hoping that the vibes are gonna be the same because I think they nailed it in terms of adapting something for the screen from a piece of writing. It was seamless as a an adaptation. So here we go. I'm kind of nervous because I really want them to do this book justice. I, out of um, Conversations with Friends, Normal People and Beautiful World Where Are You, I think that Beautiful World Where Are You and Normal People are like faultless, perfect, divine pieces of art. And then Conversations with Friends is like still super, super good, but it's not my favorite out of those three novels. But I have incredibly high hopes for this. Oh, I'm not even screen recording, what am I doing? Tech granddad strikes again, plus my laptop's on 4%. Okay, give me one sec. I got too caught up in the moment. Now we're cruising, okay, here we go. Already, the color scheme, I love it. Would it depress you to sleep with someone who loves someone else? They, <laughs> they just perfectly capture the way that Sally Rooney characters speak. Like the, with the, with, uh, <laughs> Where they can't get their words out and they like communicate like real people. Like it was the same with normal people. It didn't feel scripted, even though you know it obviously is. Anyway, sorry, I like it already. We're only five seconds in. Um, also, this woman just looks like Francis should. Anyway. They love me too. Oh, Bobby. There she is. Thought that maybe I wasn't capable of love. That there was something wrong with me. That isn't true. Oh. Okay, so this is Nick. Now, here's my unpopular opinion that's gonna get me canceled. I might <laughs> have to go into hiding after sharing this opinion, but this is not what I imagined Nick to look like at all. This is the roguest casting for me. I'd love to know in the comment section what you guys think. Like, is this what you imagined Nick to look like? He doesn't look that much older than Francis. Like, in my head, there was an obvious age difference, like physically, in the way that they look. There was an obvious age difference and power imbalance between them. Whereas, if I saw him walking down the street with her, I, I would not question it. I wouldn't think anything of it. So, I don't know about this. I'm so willing to give them the benefit of the doubt. I'm sure that the casting directors know what the hell they're doing much more than I personally do. I'm also sure that Sally Rooney was probably a part of the casting process, and so this obviously is how she maybe did envision him. So, hmm, interesting, okay. Hold on, <laughs> wait a minute, is that Phoebe Bridges? Phoebe, is that you? I'm distracted by Phoebe Bridges. It's all I can think about. Hold on, sorry, I'm going back, I'm going back. Is this an original Phoebe Bridges song? Do we, do we get an original? Oh my God. Perfect. That is perfect. I'm obsessed with it already. I love it. And that's Melissa. Do you have a crush on her? Obviously I have a crush on her. That's the head teacher in sex education, right? What? The casting is making me so confused. Francis and Bobby to me, perfect. That makes total sense. Nick and Melissa, so random. Because 
Nick and Melissa don't really match to me. Ah, uh, I don't know if it's because I see her as a head teacher from sex education. This is... <laughs> I don't know how I feel, guys, about this. It's just a trailer. When I watch the show, I'm sure this... I'll understand the choice, but... Okay, now I'm understanding the casting. <laughs> now I get it. <laughs> My marriage has survived several affairs already. I've just never been party to them. I kissed Melissa. We've been flirting when it just happened. Who knows what happens between two people when they're alone. This is so beautiful. I, I can't get over it. I also think everything ever should be soundtracked by Phoebe Bridges. Um. It's perfect. And I keep saying it, but I just love that this perfectly fits the same vibe as normal people. It's giving me high hopes. Oh. Okay, it's... <laughs> I've never had sex with a man before. It's getting a little steamy. My entire romantic history is just Bobby. I'm thinking things and not saying them. It's suspicious. What we're doing is insanely risky. Is there something you want out of this? He likes to tell people what they want to hear. The Irish accents are just the best, right? Francis. I'm in love with you and you obviously don't feel the same. Lately I feel like I'm watching you disappear. I don't think I thought about the reality or consequences. Not afraid of oh. Guys, I forgot for the last like <laughs> 20 seconds that I was reacting to it. Speechless, excited, ecstatic even. I can't wait for this. When does it come out? Did it just say May 17th, May 15th? Why did I just, I, why did my brain glitch? Oh yeah, May 15th. I like short circuited then. This looks incredible. They did what they needed to do. I'm intrigued by some of the casting decisions, but open-minded. I'm happy to give it a chance, for sure. I'd love to know what you guys think, whether these are the actors and actresses that you envisioned for these characters, and also what you're most looking forward to in conversations with friends. I'm very excited about it. I'm excited for more people to get to experience this novel in this new form, and I already know that I'm gonna binge it. So, <laughs> see you on May 15th, my friends. Bye.